What led you to first to songs of the Saddleland? Was it purely the poetry that you wanted to set to music, or it was Paul Dean's suggestion from Southern Cross Solos, and he he had an idea of of doing a whole CD of um, of musical settings of Uchiru, and uh, Paul had uh, written a set as well, and um, there there was another composer that that uh, also. Did some Ujiru settings, but it, it was kind of a never never was a completed project, and they uh, so they kept playing my piece, <laughs> which is really nice. So uh, I mean, I was I was drawn to it because of my interest in uh, in indigenous culture and you know the fractured relationship really between uh, Aboriginal Australia and, and white Australia and and this unresolved business that that we have. Mm -hmm. um, I see that. That Ujiru's poetry, you know, has all these insights. It's very, you know, it's very well crafted poetry, but it's also got these insights into uh, traditional mourning ceremonies, mm -hmm. uh, that feeling of, of loss of relatives, the, the um, respect, and um, for for heritage. And I think in, it also gives the chance to talk a bit about the reconciliation debate in Australia as well. That's that's where the, the French horn solo comes in. It was sort of the idea of of adding an, a more abstract form of, um, of of saying saying sorry. Yeah, I mean, because the that the particular poem, the dawn wail for the dead, mm. ends with a fair with a fairly positive, uplifting last couple of lines. Yes. The music's and, not. <laughs> right, yeah, it is. But it, the, the conflict is interesting because it, it makes you, you hear the, the if you want, the this theme from the horn solo, which comes back at the end, just to remind you that, well, this is my interpretation, to remind you that we haven't quite accomplished, society Absolutely. hasn't quite accomplished what, what we've set out, to, what we should have set out to do or... The reconciliation, as you mentioned, that's that's exactly the idea. Is that we haven't gotten there yet? That, mm -hmm. that idea of a of a new dawn, a bright new dawn, uh, which um, Ujiru speaks about in another poem, um, you know, is is a vision, but it's not there yet. And mm -hmm. I guess that's that's what the music's trying to express. Yeah. 